Back here, start of the second inning. Lawrence Dye here with Jill and Dye's Network. A Division I Baltimore City matchup between Patterson and Mervo. And it's a 4 3 game as we pick it up. And the ninth place hitter, Ryan Ruiz Santana at plate. And Patterson clinging to a 1 1 lead, 4 3. Here as we start the second inning. Long first inning there. Just joined us. Thank you for tuning in here on the Dinosaur Network. Little baseball action coming your way. And he hit him. First pitch, and he hit him. Ruaz is at the plate. He's on first base, excuse me. And now we're back to the top of the lineup with Isaiah Jackson. Whoa, look out. High pitch over the head, and that's a ball. Winkler still having some control problems here in the second inning. Another high pitch, still attempt, and he is safe, Bailey. Well, another still for Patterson. Someone, my brain is going to forget how many steals has been. Four three game, man on second. Passing trying to increase the lead. Another low ball. And three and oh for Winkler. And the pitch again for Winkler. Fouled off. Three and one. Pitch. Ball four. So two men on, nobody out. Jackson's second time with a pass. Great pass today and we get some time to talk to Wingle. Try to settle him in. Mustang's offense. Excuse me. Cutting his game back within striking distance and two men on now, nobody out. And right now, Patterson trying to increase that lead. And it was a 10-9 game when the first two teams met four weeks ago to start April at Kane Street you know, Pat at Patterson. Went to extra innings. High school ball here in Maryland. We go seven innings. So, everybody settled back in. <laughs> Taylor, in a bunt stance situation. Try to advance the runners. Oh, then he gets back into a regular batting stance, then he back to a batting stance. And that's low still, that's a ball as well. Taylor in a budding stance and he gets back up. Little quick batting stances here. That's another low one, 2 and 0. Oh. So Winkler again, and the wind has picked up a little bit as we had some clouds come in. Very limited chance of rain, more as we're taping this in the evening time. That end should not be a factor. 
Ball skips. Runners of France to third and second, respectfully. So now Winkler got to get out here without getting a run to come in, but uh, we got two runners in scoring position. Here in the top of the second inning. And the pitch. Another low one. Another low ball for all four. And the bases are loaded. Which is a pitcher's worst nightmare. And the opposing pitcher, Jason Nunez Benya, is coming up. And he's going to try to help his own cause. And I think that's it. That will be it for Winkler. For Winkler will go one inning. Right now he's on the hook for four runs. And it could be more. As outfielder comes in. And the pitching change. We're going to take time. Stick and stay right here on DSN. We'll be back with you. Watches is warmed up. We're back to game action. Bases loaded in the top of the second inning. Nobody out. Winkler ended up with 39 pitches thrown. And it was not his afternoon today. First pitch, that was low. And it was ball one. Base is loaded. Nobody out. Walter's in a tough bind here. That's him and Winkler have traded positions in the outfield. And pitch. Strike one. Villa trying to help his own cause. And that was a nice pitch inside there. That one, ooh, just a bit outside. Two and one. Yeah, in the time of the second inning with the bases loaded. And the pitch. Strike two. Nunez. Down. Count now one and two. Walters being effective here so far. At this point, you might even sacrifice one to get two outs if you can. As Nunez trades bats. Comes back out the wind. Like I said, has picked up some and uh, has gone partly cloudy. Did you hear the wind coming from the south. And the pitch. That one's high, two and two. I pop up. Straight center. And that was just what the doctor ordered for Mervo. And it's one away. So, back up. Tavon Mitchell. Back up to back. First pitch, and that's strike. Oh, and one. Walters doing a better job with command of the strike zone here. And his predecessor. Walters, Murphy pitching to Mitchell from Patterson. And the pitch. Strike two. Cutting the outside corner there. Got a little piece of the strike zone. Well, 
coach is trying to get a strike out. That's a shot, that's a base hit on the left side. One will score, two will come in. And the runners are gonna stay, and the ball gets loose again, and the runner's gonna advance to third. So it's on, runners on the corners, with one out, and Patterson's increased their lead to six to three. A hot shot there. And two RBIs. Well, he's had a magnificent afternoon so far. Well, runners at the corners. Mervo again trying to keep this game within striking distance. And the bunt. I'm like, is, is in effect now. Nope. Horses here, runners advancing, and he's going to be safe. Close to getting the runner at third. He looked like he was trying to advance home, but not there. Runners at the corners again, one out. It's a 6-3 game for Patterson. Strike one. Again, those runs that scored will be charged to Winkler. The only run so far that be would be charged to Walters be the one on second. In the pitch. Strike two. Got him out. Strike three call via the foul. So two down. Mervo again trying to escape. With just a three run deficit. And they can get to their bottom of the second. Tell you one thing, he's been some long innings, I'll tell you that. How into it now, just about. Mm. So Cabrera, that was always hit! Wild pitch! Seven to three. And runners at third. Not been the best afternoon for Joshua Binger today. The catcher. Seven to three game. Hasn't dropped four in the first inning. They've dropped three now in the second. In the pitch. That's strike. One and one. All the way out, I don't short that. Good balance, good balance. Hey, you outside, Ray Ball. Batted behind him, foul. One and two. Runner on third, two away. Ball is trying to get out of the inning. Unscathed. 
on his record anyway. So there have been three runs dropped in the inning. And that was due to Winkler, the last pitcher out. Pop foul right behind us. And the pitch. That one's high. So it's two and two to count. And they said for once, she's trying to get out of the inning. That one's in there, count is full at three and two. So a runner at third, counts three and two. Slapped right to the pitcher, and that ends the inning. Patterson gets three more on the board, and in the bottom of the second we go, 7-3, Clippers. <laughs> bottom of the second here at uh, Northwood Field. Joshua Benya, the catcher. Trying to help his cause and get a dent into this lead. We misquoted you. Lead is eight. It is eight to four. And four runs came in for both innings so far for Patterson. That's a wild pitch away, and that's a ball. One and trying to cut into this lead. That's another high pitch, 2-0. Oh. So Jason Nunez, latter part of the first was losing grip on the strike zone, and a lot of that has continued in the bottom of the second. Strike one, 2-1. Nunez with the pitch. Strike two. Two and two now. There's Nunez. Gets back into the strike zone for Pattis. Two and two count. And I got him. Got him on the ankle. So a free pass. Third hit batsman so far. And again, Mervo trying to cut into this lead as Winkler, the starting pitcher, trying to cut into this lead to help the team's cars here. And a ball, second one on uh, Pena. Another outside pitch. That 
That was in there for a strike. That one was high as well. Strike two. And the pitch. That's high, count full at three and two. Struck him out looking. And one down. One is up. One out. Eight four lead for Patterson. That one's in there for a ball. That's a Lagler right there. Tried to get the tag. That's going to be a long one. He's hey, hey, gets away. No one's going to come home. And Mervo gets another one on the board, and they're down by three now, eight to five. Well, the catcher, she was able to advance to home off the wild pitch, and the runner advances to second. The manager and the pants and the umpire getting to go. So the lead is eight to five for Patterson. But we can cut into it. And he skates and gets away. Third base will be the advancement for Waters there. So runner on third. One away. And for Rayon Smith, huge at bat right now. You can do. That one almost got away. And he did not. Eight five game. Here in the bottom of the second. A bunt. That's a foul ball. Foul ball. So count it two and one. And the pitch. Strike two. Pitch. Count is full. So it's a 3 2 count. Runner on third, one away. Mervo trying to, trying to chip this lead away some more. 8 5 game for Patterson. Pitch. And that's foul. Foul away. Foul away. Count is full, three and two. The pitch. 
Call four. Ping it now. Got him out! But he's gonna fence! And he's safe! And the Mustangs with N2! So they got this now call, but the ball got away. And the Mustangs take advantage of it on the base pass. And it's a two run game, eight to six now. They're in the bottom of the second. You know one thing, you want runs, you got it in this one today. And Patterson trying to protest there. That's how you get down that line, man. That's how you get down there. I like that, right? You made that. Justin Jefferson at the bomb. Faked him there. Two box already on you guys, by the way. 8 6 game. And he hit him. Hit him right in his back. So it's two on, one out. And the go ahead run is coming to the plate here from Irvo in the form of Jeremiah Lynch. And I do feel we gonna have a pitching change, uh, perhaps, or at least a talk. At least I have a talk. Yep. Thank you for checking us out, by the way. And we do have a pitching change. Gonna have a warm up, and we'll get this quick advertising. And we're gonna go to break. Thank you for joining us here on the Dice Money Network here on YouTube, the Mothership. Check us out on the Twitter and Instagram at Dice Money Net, and of course on Facebook. Our official Facebook page, Dice Sport Network. That's now Joshua Martinez is in the game. We get a little time to warm up, and we're gonna take a pause for the cause. We'll be right back. Stick and stay right. Back here, bottom of the second inning. Still, we had a pitching change. Martinez is in. Runners on. Tried to bunt a strike. The go-ahead run at the plate. In the form of Jeremiah Lynch. And the pitch. That was high. Trying to go to third and he's out. It was a double steal. And the runner got the second, but the third base runner was called out. So it's two out now and just one on. That's in there for a strike. Mustangs down. Take the six. Here in the bottom of the second. That's a strike? Wow! Who knew? That's the end of two. Mervo cuts in the lead. They're still down two runs though. Eight to six. Back with the third inning. Coming up.